I would say that I'm very honored to be part of this very important occasion because this script represents a significant milestone in the development of the rice sector in the continent. One, this is mobilization of global talent and resources to solve local problems. And it has never been second to anything so far happening in this country. You see, if we think of our predicament, especially in Africa, probably that has been touched on by Dr. Akintayo, heightened food insecurity and poverty. All premise on the simple fact that our agriculture is underperforming because we are using very little science. Too little science. One, it doesn't mean that research was not taking place, R&D, it was. But what is this blame is that the R&D configuration has a lot to be desired. It defines a linear relationship of stakeholders in which so many stakeholders were left out and that impacted negatively on technology uptake and utilization of science information because it complicates the transfer of technology and the adoption of technology. Now, there's a proposed new paradigm that's being pushed by the African Union technical arm. Nepal has been promoted by the FARA, that's Research for Development. You see, and the crypts, the way I observe, is definitely in line with that new paradigm. One is embarking on value chain, value chain approach, which was not the case for a very long time. You know, starting from the farm produce through the continuum to the final product demanded by the customer. You know, with the segments and the linkages that connects all the dots in between. Involvement of actors. You see, this put into the context of socio-economic, socio-cultural conditions as it is present in Africa, as well as the complexity of our farming systems. We have to adopt this new paradigm to give chance to technology adoption in order to at least enhance productivity so as to alleviate food insecurity and poverty. This would bring me to the relevance of the national agricultural research systems in the whole process of the, of, of the scripts. I think the Nazis are indispensable partners in this process. Well, Africa Rice has been using the NAS as a medium to reach farmers. Because the NAS, they are the very interface and the inevitable entry point to the agricultural stakeholders of any country. So their involvement is a must, is, in, is indispensable. And the Crips has taken that on board, and the Nazis have seen uh, the, 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 the Crips as an opportunity, and very much welcomes the Crips. It's an opportunity to, end, to strengthen their capacity, because most of the time you say, oh, the Nazis are weak. But the crisis is an opportunity to strengthen the capacity of the Nazis, especially where Nazis have comparative advantages. 
opportunity to strengthen nurses based on their comparative advantages. It's opportunity for technology transfer for the nurses. So in that case, from the perspective of the nurses, we give a 100% support to the cribs. Now, I've also observed um, that um, with the elaborated work plans presented here, with all the defined milestones, the, the, the activities that I will be undertaking to achieve those milestones, and the time, the timelines to achieve those milestones. Well, it's suggestive that, if I can quote from NASA, the crypt is ready for go. Now, um, what I've observed that um, there is nature, there is nurture. And I think the crypts is combining both, using genotypes, the power of genes, to solve problems, which is, of course, given our socio-economic, socio-cultural condition, is more cost-effective and probably more sustainable. But at the same time, we haven't forgotten the nurture that in as much as the potential, the environment matters for the realization of that potential. And so it's the optimization of the environment of this genotype. So it's the, it's the, the, the cropping systems and the other um, natural resource bases that, that, that have been, uh, been, been, been optimized, the technologies to to, 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 to increase the productivity of our uh, production system at, at the same time maintaining the, the functions and services of these ecosystems. So all these things are, are taken on board in the cribs, and I think that is, that is to my view, the essence. <laughs>